Hey guys, so today I am at Soft Noodle Bar. We are at their Irvine location this time. So they have another one in Buena Park, but this one just opened up and the food looks incredible. So I'm starting off with this bowl. This is the Anthony Bourdain Pho Bowl that is actually on their secret menu. Let's try some of the broth first. Ooh, that is very good. A lot, a lot of flavors. With pho, I love to add some lime juice. some of these pickled jalapeno and garlic and of course bean sprouts. You want any veggies, Brandon? Yeah. I'm gonna take some of this, the rest. There you go. So they actually have the options of making it extra spicy as well. They have this um, spicy Sichuan pepper oil, oil that they give it to you on the side and you can add it in on your own. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna add, just add everything in, honestly, because I love spicy stuff. Okay, So I love sitting outside on the patio, but the problem is you can never get rid of all the flies, but that's fine. That just means the food is good and they want a piece of this. Ooh, that is very good spice. Alright, and in front of me I have their chicken beef. So their chicken beef comes with skinny fries. Let's try one of their spring rolls too. Look at the size of their shrimp. Some peanut spots. I've never seen spring rolls presented like this. These are actually like really nice bite-sized pieces. Mm. Sure, thank you. And the service is great. She is on top of it with the soda. The everything. Anybody that can cater to my Diet Coke needs is on the top of my list. Fred knows I'm legit getting like at least three refills every time we go to a restaurant. Your Diet Coke addiction? Yep. How's their Thai cake? It's pretty good. You want to try it? Try it. I took a little sip only because I was waiting for you to take all the pictures. Good. Before I like actually drank it or mixed it. I rarely get a Thai tea that's bad, so I did not have any doubts. Thank you so much. Oh yeah, just let me know if you guys need anything else. Thank you so much. Awesome. Oh, okay. Spicy, huh? Very good though. I know, I love it. I just can't handle it. <laughs> Every time. I always... Are you spilling yourself? I always end up getting... Anytime I get Szechuan food, I always end up with oil on my shirt. Oil? Cool. And like, that stuff takes forever to get. It's worth it. I do one more. I feel like it's the first time I heard you say it slaps. Something slaps. I keep saying it because you keep Is saying it. Is it because of me? I feel when you hang out with people, you start catching on to like what they say. Yeah. yeah. From you. I mean, when you hang out with me, sometimes you break out into a country accent just to like just the fit play in. along. Just yeah. fit in with you. Yeah, eventually like, you're going to be talking to your gamer friends and all of a sudden you're going to sound like some boy and you're going to be like, Wow, what are you talking like country? 
I do that in meetings sometimes. Okay. Like, I'll just say a word, but, like, it'll come out with an accent like that, and they'll be, like, I'll end up catching it. I don't think anyone else even hears it, but then I repeat it, like, three times because I laugh at myself. I like that saying though. It slaps. It slaps. It's straight flames. But it's a good point. If you want any more meat, you can take some of this. I'm waiting on mine to like cook. Let me try the meat on this one. It's really good. It's like beef belly. Ooh. Yeah. Move over, carne asada fries. I've got shaken beef fries. Yep. Oh. vegetable in this Anthony Bourdain bowl. It's really good. So the vegetable isn't just plain, it actually has a texture. Do you know when vegetables are usually in like a soup? They're usually just very, very soft. But this one actually like, there's a grill marks on there and it's like a little bit hard, a little Ooh. chewy, yeah. That's, yeah. I don't think I've ever had soup where they actually did that ahead of time. Is that green onion? Yeah. Oh, it is grilled. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's left. Yep. That's so good. Secret menu, Anthony Bourdain bowl. That's so good. I've never had grilled veggies in soup. In soup oh. oh my god. That just changed everything. Brandon, we have a uh, very uh, obvious, long-standing relationship together. We're still caring for each other. It's my brother. Thank you, brother. Brother. Thanks, sis. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you still have to do the one chip challenge. You still sound like a hentai girl. Right? Oh yeah, that's this weekend. Yeah, I gotta practice. You sound like a hentai girl? I don't know, my voice has been pretty deep lately. You know, that is actually very interesting. You do have a pretty deep voice. But you're like really kawaii. Like, Jude has a pretty high pitch voice. Yeah, when he gets loud too. Like, I can't be loud and have a deep voice, but like... Quieter and so I feel like I'm in the basement. You just tell us those words. Uh, All you hear is vibrations. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what I'm saying, you just hear a vibration in your ear. Yeah. yeah, I feel like the only time my voice is higher pitch is like when I'm casting or like commentating or something. Because then I talk like this and I sound way more enthused. You, <clears throat> you have a powerful voice acting. When you did the Leonard Snart and Rick, oh, yeah. that was pretty good. That was actually, it surprised me. That was impressive. I didn't expect that from you. Like, legit. I was like, holy shit, you actually sound like fucking Leonard. Like, you caught the character. Maybe it's from all the anime that you watch, but who knows. But it was, it was good. All the anime featuring DC. <laughs> no, but just like knowing how to like switch the character and the style. I was like, wait, you actually just sound like them. It was pretty good. Cool. Which is why it's weird to me that I can't sing very well. Because, like, I can do a lot of different voices. Well, but, like, I can't do a singing voice, which is weird to me. Well, do you have a musical background? Have you been in a band or anything? 
when, I was, when I was younger, like I was in choir for school and then I had to play recorder in tablet school and then from there, I mean, I played like instruments though, like piano, trombone, saxophone, bass. Interesting. But then one day, I guess, I, I just became very monotone. <laughs> Unless I'm doing a voice, but I, I still haven't learned the ability to do a voice that is someone singing. But the day I do. I mean, if you really want to get into it, if you really want to get into voice acting, like, you eventually kind of want to Because for a guy having a deep voice, it's like a really good win. Because it's smooth. You actually have a very smooth voice. I actually have a few viewers saying, oh, Brandon's voice is so smooth and calming to listen to. Really? I've never... I've had people say, like, they liked it. But I've never had someone tell me my voice is smooth. I don't know. I read my comments. I mean, I always respond, but I read them. Scan them at the very least. Well, whoever said that, thank you. I appreciate it. I forget where. Just because like, it's in all over the platforms and stuff. And, you know. But I remember. It's super small. Oh! So soothing. The soup is more soothing than Brandon's voice. <laughs> JK. The soup Brandon show. has a sooth Brandon has the soothiest soothing voice. I have a souping voice. I wonder why it's called sub noodle. It's like slurp. Like slurp noodle. Because the I the logo is kind of like S L U. Are, like, you can kind of see it, right? S L U, like. It's like an L that you bet in half. Yeah. Instead of letting it be a ninety degree angle. Oh, good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> like I said, excellent service. Like he has got me nonstop diet coke. Like that's all I can ever ask for, really. Like if you really want me to shut up at a restaurant, just give me diet coke go to one of those burger joints like i don't even eat the burger just get the endless fries and give me because like usually they're both refilled there's endless fries and the diet coke is usually like a refillable soda that's all i ever need i'm curious why it's so supplementary supple supply <coughs> Soup, but <coughs> oh, spelled wrong. <laughs> God damn it, Brandon. I'm in the middle of choking on spices and laughing. Wait, I'll try one of these golden bowls. Oh, it's a bun bao. This is a very, very traditional Vietnamese flavor. Have you had bun bao? I think. Mm. Yeah, that's so good. Wow. It's very strong flavor. And it's like there's a, I believe it's, it looks like pork, pork or beef. But the goldenness is so crispy. I don't know, like it's fried it or something? But it's so. It's like a light fry. Yeah, so soft and fluffy on the inside. I'm going to try one of these meatballs over here. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, you're welcome. Thank you. Mm. Because it's like, it's just so engaging, you know? 
it was, it was good. Very pleasant surprise when I woke up. I was like, oh my god. It's because everybody looks at you and they see ooh girl, so they don't expect you to be like, oh oh girl. <laughs> I need a bunch of food. <laughs> oh my god, that's the epiphany of millennials talking. You thought it was a oo woo girl, but she was an oh woo girl. <laughs> oh god, I don't know if anybody understood that. I don't think my audience understood Probably that not. as well. They're like, I don't know what you're talking <laughs> what, about. What, what tarnation is this what young tarnation? man talking about? Oh well, what's an oh woo girl? I think it was one of my tweet drafts. That I, my drafts are so cursed. And one of them, I was going through it yesterday, and one of them was just like, she hit me with a ubu, so naturally I hit her back with that ubu, and that was it. I just never sent the tweet. It was just, I don't remember why I typed it. I sent out a tweet that I drafted like back in January that like I have told multiple people and just never posted, which was, why are they called palm trees when they don't have hands? Brandon, you're the same. I'm gonna send you a screenshot of my tweet drafts later because they're, some of them are really funny and some of them are just like, why? We're doing really good, thank you, thank you. One of them just says, in our latest patch, we decided to give Zaya a gun to keep up with other EDCs. And that was it, that was just, I don't know why I drafted that. One of them is just me my drafting my feelings, which is, Getting hit by Mord ult, or seeing Mord cast his ult on your ADC just feels like he... We're getting a third one tomorrow. Oh, wow. Hi. Yeah, I know. It's a, it's, she likes brown. We have I want a black and white. A red one so bad. It's so pretty. Aww. Thank you. Fine, yeah. Have a good day, you guys. Dude, Nala is just a people magnet. Ooh. She's more famous than you. She can be. I don't doubt it. She's so wholesome. Ooh, all right. Yeah. What a meal that was. That was phenomenal. Oh, I, I have to do one bite. Are you gonna one bite the? the no, I'm gonna one bite this. Hi right, guys, eating the food here at Subnuda Bar. This is their golden bowl. I'm gonna one back this. Mm. Mm. Did you intentionally say that with an accent? <laughs> You say, all right, guys, I'm at Sup Noodle Bar. I'm going to do my one bite. I start doing it just What in tarnation? People want to ask you, <clears throat> Brandon, what's it like hanging out with Raina? I just see her shoving shit in her mouth all day. Very wholesome. As in, she puts the whole sum of food in her mouth. <clears throat> These are some of the best spring rolls ever. The sauce is just perfect. Get the food and get that. Mm. <laughs> Alright guys, my bowl is done. This food is phenomenal. Definitely come check this place out. What do you think of it? Nice. So, we're at the Irvine location. They have another one in Buena Park as well. Awesome service, awesome food. Definitely come check it out. <clears throat> So what I think of it, and my head did a 50-50 coin flip on saying yes and doing 
and just staring at the camera. Uh, then I thought to myself, none of those are answers. I like how you share the dot process, like, after, like... I gotta share, yeah, I gotta, I gotta explain why I do certain things. Alright, guys, well, that was my experience. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you visit Stuff New to Mart in either O'Brien location or Orlando Park location, that's on the right center. But hope you enjoyed this video and um, go out and get yourself some fun. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye, Bye guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed it, and make sure to check out my website for all my merchandise. I've got clothing, prints, and stickers all up on there. And make sure to check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming, and on my Instagram page, I do a lot of giveaways, and on my Twitter page, I also give a shout out to where I might be, so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey okay and then check out my other videos and again make sure you subscribe thank you so much for watching guys see you next time bye bye